And then we'll look at also the storefronts themselves. And we have a couple of of different categories of elements that you can have on the streetscape. Streetscape is basically everything that's on the sidewalks. Examples of what that might be shade and shelter and marketplace. So these are just some of the categories that we came up with. You might have additional ideas. You might have other categories of stuff, and we'll try to figure out how to represent that on this game board. Hi, my name is Melissa Robbins, and I am a resident here in the city of Philadelphia. And I joined a group that would um, allow us to um, designate, uh, create the kind of sidewalk that we want in front of stores. Um, so one of the things that mattered most to me was greenery, and why, why. Do trees and plants and shrubs and flowers matter? Well, when you go into certain neighborhoods in the city of Philadelphia, take for example, if you go to Dilworth Plaza, if you go to Manioc, if you go to uh, Old City, say for example, you see beautiful trees aligned the sidewalk, sometimes lighting is placed in the trees, and it's so inviting when you drive through at nighttime or on a sunny day, you see the beautiful trees, you see the beautiful flowers, and it looks inviting, it beautifies the neighborhood. Um, I'm pretty sure that it increases the value of the neighborhood, and it, and it makes people want to be there. Uh, not only that, if you think about Southwest Philadelphia, we think about the power plant, we think about so many um, car shops. Well, we want to make sure that we purify as much oxygen as possible. We know that we have an influx of people and children that suffer from respiratory diseases. So we want to take that in consideration. We want to make sure that we have as many green spaces as possible here in the city of Philadelphia so residents feel valued, so they feel like their communities matter just as much as any other community in the city of Philadelphia. So I strongly urge the planners to really, really really uh, think about green spaces um, and just beautifying these shopping corridors and furthermore it's just going to make the shopping experience all the better. So um, it's great to be here with so many residents, shop owners and planners and hopefully we'll come out with a great product that you all will be proud of. So that so you're thinking of having some of your produce on display, some of your groceries. What? I mean, especially if they're on Friday, they can't read a sign. Hair braiding because it's something that unites all of them. Most of them love that hair braiding. Yeah. Anyway, I, I I think we should ice. Okay. The food. Food. Yes. The food. That's good. Because um, we almost we eat almost the same, but we call it different name, and we prepare it differently. But we eat, we eat palm oil, fufu. We eat this, we eat this, it's the same, but this is a plenty for food, and this is from the, um, you see here, this is from yam, the same as this, it's the same mama choice, but different name is the same, this is this almost the same, I mean, I mean, this and this, but it's just like a different brand. Nigerians eat it, Nat Liberians, red Ghanaian, red oil, we all eat kind of the same kind of food, mm -hmm. but 
is prepared differently, mm-hmm. and we call it different, you know, differently. Right, right. But the food is, you know, unifies uh, 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 the African community. We are-